and I had a client email me earlier and said that he could not get to log into his site. Now what he had done is he had changed the domain name in his blog and I fixed that. But have you ever created a blog a couple months later you go back can't remember the password uh, don't no longer have access to the email that you used so even clicking on lost your password you can't get your email. As long as you have access to your cPanel you can still get into your blog and this was the case with with my buddy Rick. Okay, he he just couldn't get into his blog. So what I did was I logged into his cPanel and I typed in the find phpm because what I want to do is get to the php my admin. So when I click on that, it's going to open up a new window. Now, I do not recommend playing around in my ph in php my admin unless you know what you're doing. Okay, but I learned this simple trick. It works. So you have to find the database for the blog. In this case, here it is. So we're going to find the database. And what we're looking in within PHP My Admin is the WP users. All right, now here's the user password. Well, that's not obviously the password that, that my buddy Rick used. This is what's called an MD5 hash code. Okay, so you can't just come in here and type a password. It won't work. Okay, so here's his nickname. So what you have to do is you go to Google and, and what I did was I typed in MD5 hash generator. And I, I use this site here. It's rather simple to use. When I get to the site, I type in what I want for my password. Now, I'm going to change the password right after I do this video, so don't, you know, it's not going to work for you. Okay, so I'm just going to use something simple for now. So this is what my, what I'm going to log in in the blog with. So I'm going to generate an MD5 hash, and it's, it comes up down here. So I'm going to copy that code. I'm going to go back to my ph the php my admin click on wp users i'm going to click the edit button here and once that opens up here's my password string my md5 hash code and i'm going to paste that new code and once i click go doesn't really look like I did anything but just know that it works you can you know look here to see if the new hash code is in there so I'm going to go back to my blog and I'm going to log in with what I just created my password and if you do it right you should be able to get right into your if you do it right you should get be able to get right back into your blog and that's what I've done here. So I hope this helps. This is Holly Powell with nonstopsocialmedia.com. Have a great day.